Hi everyone, my name is Carlos, and here I will explain what a Microsoft 365 administrator is. Every Microsoft 365 business subscription has a user who manages it, and do things like adding other users, reset password, verify your domain, and assign licenses. This user is the administrator, or also known as the admin. Depending on how your business operates, the admin could be someone in your IT department. Or maybe it is you as the person who signed up Microsoft 365. By the way, if you want to ensure an easy sign up and happy Microsoft 365 setup, here in the description I'm leaving a link to a mini course that will guide you step by step to complete the process. Now, the admin has access to the Microsoft 365 Admin Center, where you will have the necessary tools to manage the subscription. How do you access it? First, Sign in your Microsoft 365 account and then click on the nine little dots in the upper left corner and look for the admin icon. It will be there only if you have the admin role assigned. Once you access the admin center, you can execute many admin tasks, like managing users' accounts, for example. You can click on Users and then Active Users. You can add users reset password, and if you select the user, you can assign their licenses. The admin can set up your email service with your own domain name. You can click on Settings and then Domains. Once the domain is enabled and verified, the admin can create users or email accounts with your own domain name. The admin can also manage the security. Multi-factor authentication is part of the security default and it is enabled within 24 hours after signing up your subscription. The admin can also manage passwords, expiration policies, or enable self-service password reset. This is done within the organization settings. Then click on Security and Privacy tab. All the important tasks are under the billing section. There, you can purchase additional licenses, upgrade or cancel part of your subscription. You can also update the billing information. Admin users can also check for any non-issues under the Health section. If a user reports an issue, one of the first places to check is here. There, you can learn about current and past issues. Now. If you, as the admin, need support, you can request it within the Help and Support tab. You can start by asking questions. If you can't find the answer that you're looking for, you can write an email, make a call, or request a call. Within the Microsoft 365 Admin Center, the admin can access specific admin panels, like for example, Exchange Online, to manage your email service. Microsoft Teams, SharePoint, Security, Compliance, and Identity Center. The admin can create all the admin users and delegate some or all of the admin tasks to help you keep your Microsoft 365 subscription running smoothly. Be aware that all the admins with the global admin role can delete or remove your admin role. So be cautious when creating or assigning all the administrators. Well, there you have it. Admin users are very important for your subscription. And this is just an idea of what he or she can do for your subscription. If you like this video, hit the like button or leave any question below. As always, I hope to see you next time. Remember, stay secure, stay tech savvy.